My name is Courtney Yearman. Shelby Nichols. Helen Winston. And I'm Sarah Jensen. We'll, we'll be doing a poem called The Two Queer Girls and an Ally. Oh, but we're from and we're in From the producers of Two and a Half Men in the Film and Diversity Quota of the Fox Network, it's Two Queer Girls and an Ally. Following the adventures of a bush lesbian and all her short hair breast out glory. My pastimes include hanging out at Home Depot and plaid. Your average miniskirt plaid, red lips, slutty bisexual who swings. Both ways. And their ally friend. I you know, love gay people. <laughs> all all rubbing elbows under, under one roof. roof. We fight over girls. We, we fight, fight over, over boys. boys. All while operating within the boundaries of our labels. Make sure to set your DER so you don't miss bisexual's latest partner. Hey, how did you get her number? She stopped by my room after she left yours. Oh, well, I have plenty of other options. Watch as the adorable ally uses her culinary skills for the common good. I spent the whole day baking rainbow cupcakes, rainbow cookies, rainbow collar, rainbow crepes, and rainbow baklava, all for you. <laughs> Would you hence stop clucking and toss me the keys to my truck? I'm late for softball practice. And make sure to not miss the season finale. I'm town. Has anyone seen my leather wristband? Did you touch my red lipstick? Am I wearing enough human rights campaign wristbands? This is so outdageous! Everyone will be talking about this commercially viral sitcom crammed with characters and stereotypes the only way you can accept them. But I am not a character. Being bisexual does not mean that I'm promiscuous as if I should be condemned for being either. I am not a character baked goods and, and enthusiasm are not the sole components of activism. I am not a character. Team sports and truck purchases are not lesbian prerequisites. For the last six months, I've been in a committed relationship with the woman I love. I have been working to further my education since my best friend came out to me when I was in sixth grade, and I thought it was a phase. I'm sorry, Katie. When my girlfriend and I go out to dinner, she always pays, and I could listen to her talk for hours. Creating sitcom characters that reduce human beings to cardboard cutouts enable society to openly mock differences and promote stereotypes. It, it breeds ignorance and a freak show audience mentality. And it teaches that it is a punchline to be an ignorant ally, a promiscuous bisexual, a masculine presenting lesbian, boardroom pitches, and an attracting new audience. As, As if who we love is a trend to be capitalized upon. I do not read from a script. I do not pause for a laugh track. I am not in a costume. We, we are, are not actors. actors. I understand my privilege and that to be an ally is more than t-shirts and wristbands. I'm not curious. I'm not confused. I love who I love regardless of gender. I dress the way I dress and cut my hair to feel comfortable, not to fit into a societal role. This, this is, is who we are. are. So tune in, America. We, we are, are not characters. characters.